I'm up. One o'clock in the morning, can't go to sleep, so I'm like, you know what? I'm finna make some Dragon's Dogma content. Why not, right? Alright, so. I've been seeing a lot of comments up under my videos, right? I love the engagement. I truly appreciate y'all. Make sure you like and subscribe and cut on that notification bell as well, because I got plenty more coming. But, it was one comment that truly stood out to me. And I was like, you know what? I gotta make a video about this. Why not? Perry Davis. Perry Davis goes to say, personally, what I think Dragon's Dogma 2 needs, one, as you stated, more enemy types, bosses. Two, but also more gear, weapons, armor, more skills for each vocation, and more vocations, advanced archer and thief, hybrid thief, archer, and etc. I agree. I would have loved to see that. I think if they would have done it that way, then we would have more vocations to solo with. And I, I'm a big solo player, all right? So that's the first thing that comes to my mind when I read that, you know. Perry Davis might not be talking about soloing. They just want more vocations and stuff. But me, I want more vocations so I can solo. But number three is what got me. Listen to this. And lastly, and this is a tough pill to swallow for a lot. But a co-op mode where we play as the puns trying to save the Arisen, this locks us out of hybrid overpower vocations, and they can do so much with this. A dungeon crawler-like experience with a rogue-like Illum. I 100% agree with this. I would have loved if this was in the game. Just playing with other people would be enough to put a big old smile on my face. I never got to play Dragon's Dogma online. Maybe some of y'all did. I didn't get to play it. I would have loved to play with humans. <laughs> like other humans that could think of strategies and stuff. I don't bash the puns. It's not that I don't like the puns. I done said this in older videos. I used to play with the puns all the time. But it's, it's different. When you playing with someone who can actually think, who can actually, you know, if you set up a trap, they won't mess it up. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong. You're going to always have some players that don't know what's going on. But once you find them people that you really click with and they know what you about to set up, oh, man, it comes together like peanut butter and jelly. I don't know if they can add multiplayer in the DLC, but y'all smash that like button so we can get it out there. You know, share the video. Let's get it out there, man. Dragon's Dogma 2 DLC, we want some multiplayer. With offline mode as well for the people who don't want to play with other people. Man, I can only imagine how fun it would be going through, like, bitter black dungeons with other human players. <laughs> it's like, it would be, it would be nice. It would be fun, chaotic. Man, they should really do that. <laughs> they should really consider doing that. I think it would be a lot of fun. Man, I love seeing comments like that. But, man, I'm not going to hold y'all no longer, man. I appreciate everybody for liking my videos, for subbing to the channel. Cut them notifications on because I got more coming. All right? We got plenty more coming. But with that... Like and subscribe. Cut on the notification bell. I'll see y'all later.